we are doing everything in our power to stop these kinds of attacks. The Obama administration has a policy of avoiding the phrase radical Islam when it comes to terrorist attacks. But after the Orlando mass shooting, neither of his potential successors has shied away from the term. And, you know, whether you call it radical jihadism, radical Islamism, I think they mean the same thing. I'm happy to say either. Islamic radicalism, and that's a very, very important term, a term that the president refuses to use. But Obama isn't budging on the issue. He said labeling terrorism Islamic is not just useless. It's a political talking point. It's not a strategy. But dangerous. Fueling ISIL's notion that the West hates Muslims. The president offered a vocal defense of his national security and counterterrorism efforts, pointing to airstrikes on ISIS and the raid that killed Osama bin Laden. Obama said none of these efforts have been hindered by refusing to use the term radical Islam. Obama also called on Congress to pass new gun control laws, specifically referring to legislation that would keep people on the no-fly list from purchasing weapons. For Newsy, I'm Eugene Daniels.